Hi guys, today I'm going to be dyeing some hair extensions and my own hair, but this video is especially for these extensions which I got sent by VP Fashion, they're all falling out of this. Um, they didn't look like this when I first got them. I then set a video of me opening the box so you can see what they look like when I got them. Since then, I have purple shampooed them twice because I wanted to take the yellow out of them a bit so that they would, um, the dye would stick to them better. So I did that twice and I let them dry and then I brushed them through and they actually look better than when I got them because when I got them they were super straight and they didn't really go with my hair texture but now the texture is a bit more like my hair so I think they'll blend better. Yeah, I think we should just get going to be honest with you. My hair at the moment is slightly tinged purple but I think it'll be okay. But for the dye, lime cream. I used lime cream before with the blue and it was so nice so I thought I'm going to do it again. This time I'm doing multicoloured hair again. It's the best hair. I didn't want to buy the massive tubs of hair dye because I'd have to buy like seven and it would come to a lot of money so I just got the samples again and I think this will be enough. What do you think? It's quite a lot. I got two of every colour that I got. Let's go through the colours. So I have Bubblegum Rose which is this really cute pink colour. Cloud. I have Chocolate Cherry. Mint Ice, Anime, which is the blue I used before and I really really liked it. Pony, Kawaii, Neon Peach, Tweet. I went for quite unusual colours, I hope it will turn out really nice. I need to sort out what order I want to do them in though. So. Right, you need to help me decide on this because I am not sure. I know you can't help me because you're not actually there. Hi. That's, that's how I'm going to do it. Yeah. On the website, the Lime Crime Hair Dye, I had this problem last time, it says apply to clean, unconditioned hair. It doesn't say if it needs to be towel dried or slightly wet or wet, so I think I'm just going to dye it onto my dry hair now. I think that's what I did last time, but I can't remember. And it worked out pretty well, so I'll do that. Let's get started. I'm excited. I'm wearing my special t-shirt that I can get dye on, so don't you worry about it. <laughs> That's how much you get in one sachet, which I think is pretty good. I would say that it's like one big hunk of a section. I'm just going to use my hands. It's fine. It washes off. I'll take my rings off. Second. Cloud. I have to say, this is almost the colour of my hair now, so this part isn't going to change that much, but these dyes smell amazing by the way. Third is chocolate cherry, and this is quite dark, so it's going to be a contrast between these two. I'm going to put it in this dirty purple bowl because... Fourth, we have Anime, which I've used before and I love this colour. I've had to really wash my hands proper, proper because the next colour is Mint Ice and it's very light. Sixth one is Kawaii. Facebook group, love you lot, 
and someone suggested I move this purple around because it was next to yellow and it was a bit of an iffy combination so I'm going to put this here because I think it will blend in quite nicely plus I've already got pink at the front so it made sense so I'm going to be putting pony on now got blue on my lip next section and I'm going in with neon peach now we've got tweet Last one, kawaii. This is coming out a completely different colour to what I thought it was going to be. Don't look at the packet, and no, look at the colour. Hmm. Hello, we've changed locations and we've changed camera. My other camera ran out of battery, but we're going to start dyeing the extensions. In this set of extensions, you get four singles two threes and two fours. I'm doing this over the bath because I feel like it's just the least messy way I can do this. <laughs> I just finished dyeing the extensions. It was so stressful. Don't think I'd do it again, but they look pretty sweet to me. They're just on a hanger in the shower because I didn't know where else to put them. I'm probably going to leave them on for about an hour. My hair's been on for ages, so I'm probably going to wash that out in a minute. I'm going to wash them out individually just so that they don't bleed together because I don't want that to happen. Um, I dyed all the extensions apart from one of the three weft, weft? weft extensions because I don't need that many extensions in my hair. It just feels heavy. So, my hands are pink. I'm going to wash my hair off and I'll come back in a minute. Hello. It is the next morning and I'm going to style my hair, put the extensions in and see how it looks. So here's the end result. I think it turned out so nice. The extensions look really good. My hair is really thick, so it's kind of hard for them to blend in, but they, they're doing a pretty good job if you ask me. I really like these extensions, they're really high quality. They I put them through a lot of dyeing yesterday and they are fine they haven't changed the quality at all i didn't lose many hairs from it either so if you're in the market for buying extensions go to vp fashion i'll leave a link in the bio you cannot beat lime crime hair dyes they are so look at how vibrant they are they dye so nicely they smell amazing they fade really well i've had this blue before and it faded really nicely it faded out to nothing that might sound weird, but if you've ever dyed your hair blue before, you know that it sticks around. You cannot get rid of it unless you dye over it a darker colour. But this blue literally just dyed into nothing. And in the process, it dyed into really nice pale blue. It was really good. So hopefully all the rest of the dyes fade like that as well. Um, they're relatively cheap, which is good. And they're cruelty free, which is the best thing. I highly recommend Lime Crime's hair dyes. So... I guess that's the end of my video. I have never used extensions before. Let's just get that out there. I've never used hair extensions before. So if I'm doing something that's annoying or obviously wrong, just leave me a comment because I need to learn how to use them. I've never used them before. So if I've done it wrong, then sorry. I guess that's the end of my video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see this face and hit the subscribe button. And I'll see you next time. Bye.